We have breaking news out of Edmonton. Bradley Barton has been sentenced to 12 and a half years for killing Cindy Gladue, an Indigenous mother of three. Gladue was found dead in an Edmonton hotel room a decade ago. And Barton, a former truck driver, was found guilty of manslaughter in February. A warning to our viewers that this story contains details which may be disturbing. The CBC's Paige Parsons is in Edmonton and she was listening to the sentencing. Paige, what can you tell us about what the judge had to say? Well, in the moment before uh, he delivered that sentence, he told Bradley Barton that there was simply an intolerable level of blameworthiness in, in this case. And he ultimately uh, sentenced him to uh, 12 and a half years. And with time already served, it'll be about 11 years and 200 days that Barton has left to serve. Now, this was for a manslaughter conviction in the death of a young mother, Cindy Gladue, who died back in 2011. Um, it followed basically what the judge described today as a an injury caused by a sexual assault uh, she bled to death in in Barton's hotel room at the time and so the sentence he landed on is a, about the midpoint between what the defense and Crown prosecutors were seeking but he said it came down to aggregate aggravating factors um, such as that Barton you know didn't try to get uh, didn't try to get glad you help he didn't uh, tell the truth when he was speaking to police and others after the incident and that's how they arrived at that sentence of you know over over 12 years. Now this case has been going on for over a decade. This was actually the second time that Barton has been tried in the death of Cindy Cladu. What has happened since then? Mm -hmm. The the original trial, uh, he went to trial on a, on a murder charge back in 2015, and he was acquitted initially. But that sparked, you know, large protests um, in Alberta here and, and elsewhere because of the way that Cindy Gladry was spoken about during the trial. Uh, they relied on some, um, you know, myths and stereotypes uh, about um, Indigenous women as well as sex workers. She was, um, because uh, Gladry had participated in, in a cash transaction for sex with Barton, but um, ultimately uh, that went up through the appeal court in Alberta to the Supreme Court of Canada, and um, just the they ended up retrying him for manslaughter here today. And so it's been a really long journey. It's been very hard on her family, who in their victim impact statements during this trial shared just, you know, what a nightmare it's been for the Squan for decades and, and how much they, they really miss Cindy. So um, the family had said uh, previous to the, to the sentencing that they were hoping that after after, after today, you know, they'd be able to get some closure. All right. Thank you so much, Paige. That's the CBC's Paige Parsons in Edmonton. And if you need support and would like to talk to a counsellor, you can call an independent toll-free line. That number is 1-844-413-6649. It is available free of charge, 24 hours a day, seven days a week.